Okay, guys, this is a pile of things that I had done a long time ago. So we're going to go through it and see what we should say, try to repurpose, or just throw it all away. So I'm going to start off with, um, this, is, this was one of my favorite necklaces. It was like a choker. Got hearts here on the bottom and hearts on the top. I even did a drop heart. So, yeah, this is, oh, I don't know, it's probably 15 years old, 20 years old, somewhere in there. So, that's one thing. This was a loom bracelet got a button clasp on it square glass beads some 80 or probably 60 beads and and I do not know what I used for this but I liked it so there's something um this was a bracelet that I did not finish. I started off with a beaded heart, I mean beaded uh, flower, and then put it, wanted it, I mean these are not showing up, but these are green and yellow, kind of like a trellis is what my intentions was for it, but I did not finish, but I do like it. This was some macrame. I'm not sure what this design uh, is called. But as you can see, it's a rope-like. It's cute. Don't know what I'm going to do or if I'm going to save it. I probably will take it apart. This is macrame too. And um, you can't get, I'm not sure you can get this uh, cording anymore where I used to buy it at uh, AC Moore's is no longer uh, out there. So I don't know where I can get that anymore. Um, here is a beaded bracelet that I could probably take that apart real easy. It is way too big for anybody. Here is a beaded bracelet that I had done, made little flowers out of it. Um, here is another bracelet. This is, these are blue crystals that did not get finished. Don't know why. This was a weave bracelet off of a loom again. I really like that. I did not finish. Probably because I did not do a very good closing the end. Right? And look, guys, this is back when I was learning. So they're not going to be um, good at all. But all in all, I still like the work that I did. This is a chevron in the red and white or crimson and white that would be hard to take apart here is another this was going to be a bracelet where i started with a foundation on the back and i built up on the side i don't know if you can see it but you build it up that was going to be a bracelet <clears throat> This was going to be a bracelet. I liked what I was coming up with. I wanted a different, this is a crawl, is right angle weave is what it's called. And I wanted the sides, but it folded up all the time. So I stopped because that's not my intentions, what I wanted it to do. But I did like the design I was coming up with but just didn't finish that. Here's a bracelet that I loved. Crystal. 
but it's too busy. You really can't see the beauty of these. I love crystals, period. But you just can't see the beauty. There's three different colors in there. Here's another macrame bracelet with an elephant on it in the purple. Here is another one. This one is in the uh, rainbow. That's not finished. Here is a, another bracelet in the daisy, but I want, it was like a figure eight is what this one was. Very pretty. Did not finish. Oh yeah, I did. Sorry about that. Yes, that is finished. That is finished. Here is another one. This was a, it's a lace work, but it's in the iris, the green iris. I don't think the camera's picking it up very well. But it's a lace work. The same design, but this is in black and gold, even though they look clear they are gold they do have a little sparkle with it that was not finished and it looks like I was trying to put some kind of design on the back with some crystals which didn't turn out very well and I stopped working on that here is a one that I did that I wanted to put hearts on I don't know if you can see it it's a heart and then the heart goes on this side. There was a tutorial on um, YouTube that showed that. And I think I did pretty good on this. Pretty sure I did. Looks really good. But it didn't turn out. Okay. Here is a... I will beat around just about anything. This is a eyeball. <laughs> I think that's really funny. Let me shake it that, shake it that yet. That's an eyeball. I beat it around. It was going to be a pair of earrings. I thought that was wicked. <laughs> Say that. This was a, going to be a wrap bracelet, but wrap with a P. And the uh, square crystals in it. But I ran out of beads to make a wrap bracelet so I might have to take all of them out if I save it and make a bracelet out of it here's another one of those I made so many of these that I don't even want to see another one of these I love the collar combo but I don't want to make any more of them here is a pearl one it's white pearl with blue uh, silver line beads here is a craw bracelet, or uh, wrap, I think, with uh, wire. I did that. I think it's very pretty. I like that. Um, this one was going to be, I was trying to make a bow tie um, earrings. But I can never get it to do what I want. I probably could sit down and do it now, but I'm past it now. This was a bracelet that I had made that's got spikes in it back when everybody wore spikes. Not me, but everybody was wearing them, so I did that. Here is another bracelet. Look how pretty those are, those stones. Here is another one. I know you guys are probably saying, why don't you finish that stuff? I liked this one. I don't know why I didn't finish. Probably because I said, oh, a rabbit hole and saw this one. Because they're the same beads. These are the same beads, just 
put different ways. This was going to be a daisy bracelet. But it's not finished. Then this is the same beads also. I decided I wanted, I was wanting to do the figure eight, but I wanted it in a spiral. So this would have start this way, but the next one would have been up a little bit. And it would have, it would have went at a diagonal in a figure eight spiral. It's just the way my brain went, but didn't work. This one, um, I made my own, my own um, lace and was going to be. I just put it on here to see what it looks like. So this one is blue. It sparkles in the back. It's got a nice little base on it and blue. And this, these were going to be a pair of earrings that didn't quite turn out right. Look like little owls, don't they? <laughs> okay. Here's another one of those um, chevron bracelets, but this was a bead mix, and I separated um, the red out of it and tried to put it, but it was way too busy that it, I didn't like it after I finished it. What about this one, guys? This one is, um, look how pretty that is. That's lace work in there. And another not finished. So this one was when I was practicing peyote with a three bead stitch in a weave. So you do three beads at a time. I ran out of beads. Um, let's see, this is a wrap bracelet, a long one. When I was tinier, I mean, you hold your bracelet like this. When I was tinier, this would wrap around my wrist four times. And now I can only do three. So when you put it together, straighten it up. That's what it looked like. That's pretty. Um, this one was... I wanted the I wanted to wrap crystals around a leather cord, but I didn't like it after I did it, so that went into the junk drawer, junk pile. Here's another one that I was doing that's got a nice little cross on it. Um, did not quite turn out the way I wanted it, so it got tossed. Little tiny ones. That's really tiny. It fit my wrist. But of course, back then, I thought everybody had tiny wrists. I did. I didn't realize that I was so tiny. So there you go, that one. Okay, here's one. This was on the Kumihimo braid thing. Pink and white, and this is real tiny, real tiny thread. Um, here is Pretty. So I'm just going to pick these up and show you. This was a mandala. I have a couple pairs of these that I made for earrings for people. This is a um, the letter O. I was making letters at the time. Hearts. 
This is a coral design where I made the heart. Another heart. And then these were supposed to be earrings. Don't know why I stopped them. These are earrings, supposed to be. It's something I built up. I don't know what it was going to be. Here's a pair of earrings that um, did not, they didn't have the swag. I should have made them longer. That didn't. That's the iris. That's a blue iris or purple iris. Mm -hmm. Um, here's a pair of earrings that I probably lost the other one to. Alright, and here's a bracelet that I had made with crystals. So, out of everything that I showed you, tell me what you would say or throw away. I'm sure I could probably refurbish a lot of that if I wanted to take the time to redo it, but hey, there's plenty of nice, pretty stuff. So, yeah, tell me what you would say.